and 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 will it go 1.5 no sorry the signal is lost and now it will return to its home points now mavic mini has gone into rth mode which is return to home This RTH beep is quite annoying, so making it mute. Aha! Much better now. So at time of flight, Mini has locked and updated the home point from where it had flown away. Guys, it's all there in the video link shown up here. You can enjoy Mini's flight which it completed by going 250 meter high and covering a distance of more than 1300 meters. Wow! So amazing! So here we have a phone screen showing with all the important details along with Mini's return path video footage. Earlier it was not showing as a remote controller was not getting full transmission signal from what the hell and still strong wind warning is on asking to lower the altitude unless warning stop coming. Now it will take the same return path to reach the locked home point through available satellites. Mavic Mini mainly uses GLONASS and GPS as global navigation satellite systems which is another name of global satellite positioning systems I must say. Still strong wind warning is on but hold it hold it hold it that altitude dear mini know that you can perform and record quite well that warning is on guys it's always better to lower the altitude in strong wind warning if you are totally new to drone flying believe me it's not worth taking that risk as it may put your drone into max power load reached problem where it really struggles to keep its position steady and if altitude is not immediately lowered to a safe height there are high chances that drone will be out from RC control and will eventually fly away. On the other hand maintain the height if wind speed is not very high or there are no sudden wind gusts experienced by drone. If any such situations come across, immediately lower the aircraft's altitude to a safe to fly height and speed. Do it either in sports mode or position mode, but never do it in sea or cinematic mode, as in that mode, drone's downcoming speed will be very less. If camera's gimbal is all the way down to minus 90 degree then bring it to a level between minus 10 to minus 5 degree which will give a much broader and better view of the surroundings. Additionally do a 360 degree check by revolving drone at a stationary position to check whether surroundings are clear from any obstacles like trees power lines, towers, buildings or similar tall structures. But never do a 360 degree check when it's flying in the direction of camera view or opposite to it. Here Mavic Mini has safely reached back to its home point and going down in height. So let's take off this small bottom screen. Aha! Much better view of main screen now and it will go more better in coming seconds.
hope you liked this entertaining and informative video do subscribe my channel if you haven't yet done it and keep watching my all videos see you soon guys have a nice time At last safely landed at the same point from where it flew off.